Time for another edition of Pippins Preview as the Pippins step outside of WCL play for a couple days. Manager Marcus McKimmy with me as these Pippins prepare for the Thurston County Senators and coach. Tough series to flush out at least those last two days against Wenatchee. What kind of message do you leave your team with those last couple days to move forward with? Well, we got to get better every day. Uh, we, we know that right now. Uh, getting used to the, the, the daily schedule, the, the grind of playing a nine-inning game every day with, with you know, the pregame schedule and, and everything that goes with that. Uh, you know, that, that's what we're trying to acclimate our guys to. And, and like I said, not losing sight of the, the big picture, which is to play your best ball at the end of the season. Yeah, there's no sugar coating at 11 errors and two games just won't cut it. Is there an adjustment you can make in those situations to coach, or do you just have to let them go back out there and, and try to get better? Catch it and throw it better. Uh, you know, I, I was happy with the way we competed. Uh, specifically at the plate last night, you know our pitching's been been very consistent, and, and those guys that have done their job, uh, we we just got to play better, limit the mistakes, and and right now early in the season, uh, the team that makes the, the least amount of mistakes usually wins. Does the approach change at all when you go out of league for a couple games with a team like this? No, we're not motivated by who we play. Uh, we we need to take care of our own deal, and the guys that are here are, are fine tuning some things, and and we're. We're changing some things, and, and we've got specific approaches uh, that, that we're working on, and, and guys haven't lost sight of that. Pippins have been close the last couple days, now trying to get over the hump tonight against the Thurston County Senators. Marcus McKimmy, we thank him for his time. We'll talk to him again tomorrow in the finale of this inaugural homestand. But for now, that'll do it for Pippins pregame. Let's get you ready for tonight's first pitch.